at this point in my life, I'm a girl's girl and I want to be there for a girl who needs another girl, okay? Hello, you guys. I'm currently ready for work. I keep feeling like I'm winning in the nanny department. <laughs> then something happens and then I'm back to square one. So the secondary nanny that I got that I love so much. I love the first one too. She's young. She's thriving. I love that. She reminds me of my younger self, how I would dip into everything. I would try to do something with myself at every point. So I love that about her. You know, um, she's an entrepreneur. I love that. Love that for her. But she now at night she's supposed to come here at 9 30 and she doesn't get here until 10 and she doesn't even text and say anything and i don't really like that because i don't really like tardiness i like communication you know and she doesn't communicate and i feel like i can't even be bothered to go back and forth i did however tell her that you know i'm here until 10 or whatever so you can get here and the latest i could leave here is like 10 30 right but i think what she didn't get is what i mean by that is every once in a while when one of her clients should run like really late because like i said she's a braider so you know i'm having the issue of her just coming late and not saying anything like just coming after 10 every night and not saying anything you know and i'm just like oh i'm not confrontational let's i'm trying to do so many things i'm not confrontational so i'm just like whatever but i also get that i am paying for the service and so it would be completely fine if i said something and if i feel like i need to but you know I don't really know. So I was getting a secondary person because there are days that she's not available. So I wanted to have like another person just to fill in on those days where she isn't available. And I found one and I loved her and it's just not working out anymore. You know, she has some personal family things going on, which I completely understand because we all have families and we all have families that shit acts up sometimes in our families. And it just is what it is. And we got to make it work. Right. Uh, this is what I'm wearing tonight. I'm wearing Bombshell Passion by... Victoria's Secret. I just put on Burberry Goddess and I put on this Hermes. I don't know what it's called. I'm waiting for her. I'm not making sure I'm ready because I'm going to be taking the train. But um, yeah, so now I have to go back on care and find somebody else. And this time I hope that I find somebody that's like a permanent solution who will always be there, always be available, you know, and so we don't have to go through this process again. But also, if we have to go through it again, you pay and you go through it. And that's just, you know, how these little situations are. I don't get too worked up about like uh, things that I can fix things that I can potentially do something about because I can do something about it you know when it becomes a problem is if it's something that I can't fix I was able to resolve the issue tonight she's coming and luckily I have a holiday tomorrow and the weekend off and Monday morning to figure it out so that's potentially four days to kind of figure it out before I have to go back to work Monday night so we're gonna figure it out we're gonna find somebody and this time it's gonna be really really good you have to have a positive attitude with everything that you do in this life because if you don't then it's almost as if it doesn't even make any sense i need to do some editing i did a second exam today for math we have one more left and it's our final and then we're done and i can't believe that i've completed 11 weeks i've survived 11 weeks of this math class and i'm very very proud of myself because there was a point where i thought i wouldn't have made it through i'm not gonna lie i thought it would have taken me out and i wouldn't have made it through i'm doing the best that i can and to the best of my ability and that's all that's important you do the best you can and it lands you where it lands you and that's just where you are in this life but i'm ready to go to work i have to go i'm gonna sit down and look through care for a little bit make me a bottle and wait for her to get here mia drinks from her so that should not be an issue so the, you know the kitchen is clean and everything i think it's raining outside i would love to uber but i've ubered i think one night already because my friend was going through something and i really wanted to be there for her at this point in my life i'm a girl's girl and i want to be there for a girl who needs another girl okay So I Ubered and I was there for her and I love that I was able to support her through the season that she was going through at that moment. I bought a new edge control that this secondary nanny told me about too and I, so far I think it's pretty cool. It's nice and thick, it works for my hair. I'm going out this weekend, I need to figure out what I'm going to do to my hair. Do I want to get some black dye and dye my hair black? I don't really know. I don't really know. Am I going to straighten it? Yes, but how long is it going to last for straightened? mainly because my hair is natural i don't really know before i start looking like a puffball i don't really know but you know we're gonna make it work we're going out with the girls this week and it's gonna be a great time and it's gonna be a great time okay today i just posted on my tiktok about like 
you know, just girlhood and um, motherhood and just absolute bliss in life. And that's where I'm at right now. And I'm so grateful for that. I'm grateful for the friends that I have in this season and the friends that I'm able to keep throughout this season and throughout the other seasons of my life. You know, absolutely have to be grateful. I'm going to make some milk for Mia so that when she comes, there's a bare minimum to do. I always make sure that when they come at night, there isn't too, too much for them to do. You know, mainly because it's nighttime and it's late and everything is pretty much already done. So, you know, there isn't much to do this time of the night anyway. Because what would I be doing at home all day long if I had so much for them to do? And I'm not one of those people who feel like, oh my gosh, I'm paying you, so you got to do this, 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 and that. I think Mia's dad is more like that. But I don't believe in being a slave driver because I don't like how that feels when I am at work. And also, I don't like how um, how that felt when I used to work for other people. When I used to nanny, my first experience was, you know, the lady was something special. Okay? But, you know, we move and, and those experiences teaches us and it made me a better person because now I don't want to be that person when I'm in a position where I have to employ people. And this is not my, being my, this is not my first time being in a position where I have to employ people. So I'm no stranger to that. Anyway, my friend bought me an AirPod. This is the case that I bought for it. It's so very cute. I love it. But this AirPod is so odd. It's making all these noise. When you open it, I think when you plug it in, when you take one out, Okay, maybe it's just when you plug in it. Anyways, I'm ready to go. I'm going to edit these videos tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be an editing day, a find a nanny day, all of those things. But right now, we got to go. See you guys later. Hello, you guys. Look at her little head peeking over there. Uh, it's a Friday morning. I'm off today. Today's yeah. agenda is to, one, yeah. find me a new nanny. Yeah. On care. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um... Well, one, we're gonna start with washing my hair and everything. I think after washing my hair, I'm going to do some laundry for memes. And then during that process, I'm also gonna try and see if I can find a nanny on care. So far, I posted a job and a few people have responded. I posted the job last night, but I haven't really sat down to check anything yet. So I'm gonna clean up the apartment and use the day to do that. I know that's gonna smell lovely inside here when I start doing the laundry. And I'm so very excited about that because I love laundry day because I love the smell of like fresh laundry so yeah that's the plan for today i do want to go on the platform and see if i can do some homework as well but um for the most part that's where we're at we have fruit we have food we're we're ready to go we're ready to go but yeah i'm gonna clean me up first get her i don't know actually should i bathe her Okay, maybe I'll let her run around first while I wash my hair and do everything because half of her is going to be in the shower anyway. And then I'll... Um, yeah, I'm going to wipe um, the hallway as well and everything. But yeah, yeah. I'm going to go do some work. Me and say hi. Hi. Good job. Okay, bye. Say bye bye. bye, -bye. <laughs> Good job. High five. Good job. <laughs>